Time now for on top. Hey, Anna. Okay, so this is in the tour, the pizza tour from Steve Dolinsky, the deep dish that he loves. Yeah, I love this because it was created by a baker, Rich Labriola. Let's serve actually our mm -hmm. guest. Um, it's got this caramelized cheese edge that was made famous at Burt's and Pequod's. Uh -huh. They started in Morton Grove. So he definitely copied Burt's with that caramelized mozzarella on the mm -hmm. edge. Right here. Which is really delicious. And then there's these beautiful raw hunks of sausage with lots of fennel. Uh, there's garlic in here, this reduced tomato sauce. Oh my Rich God. likes more corn flour and corn oil than your typical deep dish. You might even need a knife and fork for this Utensils, one to cut these, yeah. yeah. But I like the fact that you could, if you wanted to, you could pick this up, it'd be a little messy, but you could get your fingers under there, you could pick that up, see, absolutely. I'm a I lady, that. Yeah. I'm a lady Delinsky. We're eating pizza, come on, <laughs> fancy. Okay, so tell me a little bit about these stores. Do you divide them by style of pizza, by area of yeah. the city? Well, it's really, it's style and area, but I really want to show people something other than the usual, the sacred cows, right? Mm -hmm. Something that you haven't had before. Mm -hmm. Michigan Avenue is typically like kryptonite to most locals. They don't want to come down here. But they, they see this pizza and they're like, wow, I didn't know this really existed. And it is delicious, right? Mm. And so I want to show even locals that you can have something, expand your horizons a little bit. Don't be like Ben Bradley and everything is just a really and home when Flossmore, right? You can get out of your comfort zone. And Naperville. And, get out a little and bit, try Bradley. something a little different, right? This, we have tourists. We have locals on our tours. By the way, it's pizzacityusa.com. Mm -hmm. You have a book coming out. And too. I got another book coming out in the fall called The Ultimate Chicago Pizza mm. Guide. It's got 50 new locations, a lot of them from the pandemic because that was a big part of the third wave of pizza in Chicago that I'm calling it. A lot of people pivoted and they just said, we're going to do pizza. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of great pizza now in Chicago, Sicilian, Tavern, Roman, Neapolitan, you know, much more, but we're just scratching the surface here. The fact that we have this unique deep dish that you never had, and this has been here for six years already. Listen, so that's what I like about this. I loved your show on CLTV. What I'm Thank still you. wondering is how did you keep your hair and Paul Conrad <laughs> lost it? I remember when Paul Conrad had hair. I met him in 93. Um, it'd be great to see him. We should get an old picture of that. It'd be great to see that. Um, but I ate a lot of pizza. I ate more pizza than he did, which is why I kept my hair. There you Sorry, go. Paul. Sorry. Uh, it was great to see you. You too. Thank you. This you was too. fantastic. Thanks for coming. Oh, this is so good.